Hey everyone, Randy here. Just wanted to share my experience of building a stealth camper minivan. So I just purchased the 2017 used camper van. Um, it's a Toyota Sienna. So I wanted to go used to save some money and not have to buy something new and then you know, ding it up on the inside. Um, so I just got the van. We're going to take a look at it. And then I'm going to build it out to be a stealth camper, but one of the constraints that I have is that I want it to be able to convert back to exactly what it was stock. Um, some reasons being that I want to be able to sell it at some point again, and then maybe go to another van. Um, and also just for day-to-day -day use, it is my primary car as well. Um, so I want to be able to use it both as my commuter car, and then whenever I take a weekend trip, can go ahead and turn it to a camper van and then take it out stay wherever we want so join me on my journey here we go so here's the minivan just got this from ikea it's a bed base my plan is to lay it out here and see if it full fits Check it out from different angles. So far, so good. Looks like it fits a little snug at the end. I have to chop off the last piece. Yeah, this is the piece. A little snug. But it's intertwining like how I hope it would. Here's the mattress I got from Amazon. Um, I already did some work on it yesterday by putting a waterproof cover over it. So I'll link to both the six inch memory foam mattress as well as the cover that I used on top of it. Um, I also got this nifty carrying case, which makes it nice and easy and portable. So here it is, it's squeezed in there. Notice that all the corners are squeezed in pretty well. And again, this is a full mattress, so anything larger than this won't fit. Um, I think the waterproof cover was definitely a good idea. Um, I'll try to give you guys a full shot of what it looks like. Show you those IKEA bottoms again. Oh, I really just wanted it there to. Kind of keep the bed off the ground. So it looks like it's doing a good job of doing that. Right. Like how they curve up a little bit. So nice little snug fit. So here's a view from the back. Looks like it can still open and close. Just want to show you real quick what it looks like with the weather tech shades up. So as you can see, pretty much blacked out. Nice and insulated too. Give you a quick tour of the outside. As you see, it just looks like it's tinted. The front, you can tell a little bit more since it's black has some reflection and for the very front you put the silver lining board. 